Troops, how you doing? It's your boy Jay. Welcome to another episode of Eaton West Weekly. Today, we are in Sutton Coldfield. Come check it out, yeah? How are you doing? So it's your boy Jay, obviously. Uh, we're back in uh, Sutton Coldfield. We've got um, uh, a new build house that we're doing currently here at the moment. Just to give you a quick overview, just in case you guys don't remember, we had a house here originally, which was in line with that house and that house there. We knocked it down. Um, uh, in our previous video, what we had was uh, we, the site had been cleared and we were marking the foundations. That was two weeks ago. We're back here. Uh, foundations have been marked, foundations have been dug, concrete has been poured and two courses of block work all the way around. Now you guys, some guys might be thinking, yo, uh, why have you got block work on the internal skin? This block work that you see, it's from the foundations and it's going all the way up uh, two storeys. Uh, so that's what's here at the moment. Um, that's it. Boom. Troops, so come, let's take a look and um, uh, see what we've been doing. So here, right, we've got, um, uh, we got a chamber, we've got a riser, we've got the lid. The drainage is running down there. So the existing manhole that we had, that we connected into, is right next to the front gate, just down the bottom there. Um, what we're going to do, now that it's, everything's been passed and that, what we're going to do is soft sand, um, two inches, just underneath the, the pipe so it's soft. So there's nothing hard for it to crack the pipe or anything like that. Shingle over the top and then backfill it. Sometimes when you're working in a very confined space, you know, muck just keeps falling everywhere. Hence why, you know what I mean, you can see it all over the shop. We've got um, uh, a block work. Uh, we've got two cores of block going all the way around. And um, uh, we've got a 150 cavity, yeah? So new regulations and all that. We're gonna whack up here for you, yeah? Show that the, um, uh, the cavity, for new build houses now, um, has to be 150. Uh, we've got lintels that obviously go over um, the, the pipe work. You can probably see it over there. So guys, with the drainage, so you've seen the chambers there. Uh, we've got another chamber uh, just past the, uh, the uh, consumer unit down the bottom, which is gonna be covered by the way, guys, yeah? Um, and then the drainage is coming inside, yeah? So everything will be internal. You shouldn't see any drainage points on the external view. Here, what we're standing on at the moment is uh, we've got 150 mil type one. Uh, we're gonna whack a plate it all down and then we're gonna sand blind it with two inches of sharp sand, which is gonna go over the top of this and then sand blind all that. Then uh, membrane, concrete, and then the membrane embeds into the DPC course as well. So troops check this year, the next steps for us moving forward is once the concrete's been poured, uh, we're gonna start the brickwork. The bricks are due to be delivered today. Once the bricks get delivered, we start that. And obviously we do the block work inside. Um, uh, Joy steals get up to the roof fight. This house here is fairly square. So it should be um, pretty easy just to do the brickwork. Boom, straight up troops. Yeah. Troops, thank you for watching another episode of Eaton West Weekly. Remember to like, share, subscribe, tell all your friends, your family, and all that. And remember, troops, yeah, always keep this in mind. If you want that, make sure to call that or scan that. <laughs>